Hey, what's up everyone? Beatstar here with another Deus Ex Human Revolution. Let's get this shit over with, with um, part 7, Jensen's Day Off Part 2. Alright, let's do this. <sighs> what the fuck happened last night? Okay, let's go continue our quest. Whatever the fuck that quest is. Let's go pop some kids. We're gonna go for one of the side quests first of all, and let's check that out right now. We're on business. Need is safe, Shanghai Justice, or the bar tab. Mm, you know what? Let's pick this one. And that is... That way. So we're going to go all the way over there. Just to do single side quests. Pardon the uh, slowdowns. This game is running like shit right now. Let's get around. Oh, I see. Apparently, we're going to go into the train station. So, hold on to your hats. We're going in. What I'd like to say, first and foremost, is that I don't make money on any of these videos. Except the Skyrim ones, actually. I have a mutual understanding with um, Square Enix and Edios Entertainment that I can't put ads on this. So it's pretty fucking stupid. But I'm okay with it since I'm using their content without their permission and all that shit. Oh boy. Looks like I scared them already. Looks like we're going to have to go down in the hood. All the Chinese guys are scared. That's just great. My goal is not to actually focus on them, though. Let's go up here. Apparently, we're going to have to take a longer way across. Nope. Can't go that way. We're going to go one more up. Should be there. Invisible wall. Or we just have to go up one more. Oh, boy. I have a feeling. Good job, Lao Wei. I see you found the first relay. Now hack it and turn off its security protocols. Shut the fuck up, big boy. I'm gonna ban you right now. I made that uh, Stanley Rue video part two. Which is awesome. Totally. Which is the um, Ding Dong Banu part two. The return of Stanley Rue. I'm so glad I got the chance to do one of those. Come on. Ooh. There we go. Send a nuke right there. Have the access. Disable that. One down, two to go, my friend. Oh boy. Well, we're going down the tough way. Yeah. Fuck you. Like a boss. We'd have to get into a firefight if we had to do it the other way. That's just great. So now we have to go to the other one up there. Can't have any of those bell tower looking motherfuckers after us. Looks like it's inside the building. We're gonna have to find a way around. Or rather, in. Let's see. Can't get in that way. That's what I'm talking about. Easiest way up. All we have to do is go around here. Hmm. Ah, I see now. Or no, my vision was narrowed, because we can't go in either way. Looks hard to saving, big boy. Thank you everyone who takes the time out of their lives just to watch this video. I hope it's not inconveniencing you in any way, because if it does, my life is officially over. I commit Sudoku. Um, Hadoken style, and yeah, whatever that means. I don't think I can go out this way either. What the hell am I doing? I always wanted to get on this, though. Come on. Come on. You know what? Fine. You don't have to move if you don't want to. Last time it actually did go up, so kind of had me a little bit disappointed I didn't get on the first time. 
which makes me always look at it, seeing if it's going anywhere. I believe this is the only way to get in there, but how? That is what gets me so curious about this little debate. How do I get in here? Oh. Well, the answer is very simple now. I have to get up on top of here and do that, right? There you go. Hack it again. Fortify some of these. There you go. Access there you go. 200 extra credits. Good. Second relay is down. Only one remaining. Thank you, big boy. We're going somewhere. Holy shit. But at least no guards went after me. That's good. See, I'm very elegant when I do that in front of civilians. I don't want to hurt any of them unnecessarily. Because that would be murder. And murder is against my personal code. Especially when it comes to civilians. In the game, I try to kill people when it's necessary, but... If it doesn't really require me to, I'll just knock him down with a swift punch, aka a Chris Brown. <laughs> I see it now. Should be directly up here. The bell tower down there on the building. Some dead bell tower right here. Get down, take the gun. Anything else I need? There we go. Oh, I thought I saw one of those bell tower motherfuckers. All I have to do now is just hack it. So this mission was overall pretty easy. There wasn't really anything we had to fear. Oh fuck. Access grant. Well, at least I cheated a little bit. Excellent there we go. work. I'm starting the triangulation now. Should have a location very soon. Fuck her, big boy. Bye now. And I've got it. Jaya is hiding in an apartment building called the Hengsha Court Gardens in the Yuzhou district. I'm sending you her coordinates. Get over there and get us the money she owes. She owes you some money? That sounds like bullshit. We're gonna go kill some bitches. But first we have to get up and get Goodbye. moving. Oh, that guy was talking on the phone. I thought he was doing something else. They have to move right now. Sorry, pal. No one's allowed in right now. Yeah. Kiss my ass. You shouldn't be here. Get moving. Oh boy. Well, we're gonna have to go in the other way, which is taking the top route. We might have to knock a few heads because that's why Bell Tower, I'm guessing, is protecting her. All we have to do is do that and then Chris Brown some people. Yep, see? There it is right now. We can do this the easy way or the hard way. See, they won't be looking this way. Got a body here. I want to sweep. Find whoever did this. Okay. Stealth mission fail. Well, you know what to do now? It's called proudly get the fuck out of here. It means we are taking the long way in. He sees me? There we go. Let's go around. Ah, I see now. So ding dong obvious. And we had to end up close here after all. So it doesn't really look like we had to do anything unnecessary. Just go up, get in, shoot them, get out. Real simple. And 
There we are. You have my money? Let's find out how crazy I am. Who are you? Another one of Tong's thugs? Well, get out! I told him I won't pay another credit! One out! Look, I know this is- Oh, you poor boy. Having- Stealing? They got you the augmentation you needed, and they expect you to pay for it. Not the most charitable thing to do, but I would hardly call it stealing. Are you really that god? So you could- I didn't study this hard- Oh my god. Listen. You would do that? Don't thank me yet. Okay, I can convince Bobby Jow. And then when I do that, I'll be a good guy. Wouldn't have to Chris Brown a hoe. But I feel like I'm going out of my way for this mission. I had to kill a bunch of bell tower thugs and I still didn't get a Chris Brown anyone. Well, we're going out the front door, so we might get a few kills in. Surprisingly, they're both dead. Take the weapons and everything they have. All their worldly possessions. They're rather post-paranoid as shit. As I expected. So what we're going to do is make them look like idiots. By doing this. What the fuck? You didn't notice that, you dumb bastard? You dumb boy, dude? Oh my god. You yeah, all so stupid. That's just even more stupid. <laughs> We're gonna try out if how we can just get the fuck out of here. Watch this. Sorry, big boy. I'm gonna do it again. Now. All we have to do is go to the hive, talk it out with this um, Chung guy. We'll be some good kids. Let us go to the super secret club. Does anyone here understand me, damn it? Hmm. What shall we do? Not as it often do I have to play counselor at Facebook, but. Doing a pretty good job at it. Yeah, oh, fuck you, buddy. Get the cops. Don't you snitch on me, you little bitch. He's trying to kill me. No, I'm not. What? Just let me fucking take this guy. There we go. Let's go over here, buddy. Had to make me cancel my fucking mission for you. Leave me alone. Ah, I see now. We're gonna go to the hive and then uh, talk to Bobby Lau. We're gonna convince him to leave this bitch alone because you know what? I like white knighting females for once, so I'm gonna do it. Let's do this shit. One easy step at a time. So, you wanna go around here, then around here. And then finally, around here. Should be up around 115 meters. There we go. It's right across this road, and then you get in. For free. No oh, shit, I forgot. That Bobby Lau motherfucker better be in there. There we go. I have to go in here, right? Yep. None of my assumptions were wrong. That's great. As we get in, get in like that. Now all we have to do is let the game load. Deus Ex is infamous for its loading times. In case you didn't already fucking know that. But they're not as bad as Skyrim's. But then again, you die more in that than you do in here. What we're gonna do is a hostile encounter. Sup, big boy. You got a favorite poison? 
Hey, come on. You found Jaya yet? What's it good? I don't understand. I know about the Shylock scam you're running. Get her the augment she wants and then bleed her with monthly payments for the rest of her life. A cyborg with a heart of gold, are we? Hmm. I don't care. Then quit. You know what, motherfucker? We gotta think of something. I can't kill him up front. Shit. For now, I can get drunk. You motherfuckers. How to kill this guy, stealth style. Difficult thing to do. Well, not a difficult thing to do, but a difficult thing to plan out. Can't hack that. Security won't you let me. You look like a tough guy. Just remember, plenty of tough guys here. <laughs> yeah. Well, you're not gonna live anymore without your nuts, bitch. Tough guys, my ass. You're going straight into the fucking duct. Let's get in here, buddy. Nice and comfy. I'm gonna kill these kids out one by one till we have all the weapons we need. Hey, what's up, Tong? I wanna see something. Can I shoot you in the face? <laughs> That's cool. But I'm uninterested. I need to get some fucking um, actual guns to do. Blow up people with and all that shit. So apparently I can get up here. Then I can foresee the conversation from here. I don't need to. Let's try having another look around. Remember, we're not allowed down here, so. Gotta do some other stuff. That's how we get around the camera. Virus. Save. Are you dead, partner? You have to I already familiarized myself with this place. I don't even know I can call it that, but it's because it is indeed a place. Get in niggas paranoid one by one. Well, here's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna walk up like nothing happened. If they act like something happened, we pretend it didn't. That's what I suspected. You really don't. <laughs> I love using this to save myself. But, we have to get back in there. Fuck! So, what we gotta do is... Get the fuck back in there. To the Valley of Death. Surprisingly, we can't enter. Are you trying to start some trouble? I'm gonna think real hard about trying that again. Maybe not. Alright. Yeah, fuck you, buddy. Let's get into your fucking fancy club of yours. I never try hard. Ever. I usually stop short of actually... Looking like Stanley Rue, you bitches. I love corner shooters like this game. Don't move. Over here. Ah. On the 
I'm not even trying. I'm not even. When you don't press down the button, the uh, counterfire is real shitty. Now I'm empty. Well, now everyone's dead. Except this guy who's just temporarily knocked out. Take everyone's pistols. Note to self. That could have gone along a lot better if I just used some nice words. What can I get you? Now I'll have a drink. Give me a shake. Talking about a drink, right? Alright, let me have one of these good things. Yummy. All I have to do. Shanghai Shank, bitch! That's one mission taken care of. Now all I have to do is take care of the rest. Any Praxis points I need to worry about upgrading? Nah, there isn't anything good here. That was a successful mission, I must say. So, time to go on with another one. That's to take the long route, you know what I'm saying? Ah. Just because I use a gun in public, I'm super duper trouble, huh? You racist bastard. You're gonna get ding dong banned. It is not my fault, you little bitch. A shuttle station. Huh. What else do I have to find here? Oh, this is a second mission where I gotta go find out some bitch's killer. This is gonna be super duper easy. All I have to do is go in here. Talk to the Mr. X. This guy. Can't you see I'm busy? 4chan! Someone else. 4chan! Death and life have their determined appointments. What? Oh, uh, and riches and honors depend upon heaven. Very good. Right. What now? Shh. They have eyes and ears everywhere. Meet me outside the clinic. Turn left from the front and go down the stairs. I'll be waiting at the corner. Hmm, a homage to 4chan, I see. I do have a thousand uh, credits, I already know that. So it should be enough to pay for the guy. Because that's how much he's going to ask. Nice spoiler. I don't give a fuck. We have to go um, a ways down here. Yeah. You enjoy my super jump? All I have to do is have a nice talk. Here. Come on now. I'm relieved to know they sent a professional at least. They keep the on doing the hands and look down. Right. Well, though not exactly what I was expecting. I was told I would be meeting a girl. How do I know you're not an imposter or some sort of double agent? Don't think I don't know this could all just be an elaborate trap to set me up. Look, no offense, Mr. X, or whatever your name is, but I really don't have time for this. So if you could simply just give me what I came for. I'll be on my way. Yes, yes. I have it right here. Evelyn Carmichael's autopsy report. Here, take it. Thank you. I trust you will put this information to good use because accountability and justice is at an all-time low, I'm afraid. 
No oh boy. It pains me to see whatever you say. Well, all right. And what were you just saying about corruption? A deal? It no, my handlers failed to mention this little detail. Oh, I assure you, it is. Who legal? Right. No, unfortunately, I did not have enough money. But I get to keep all my money, which is good. You're gonna have to build me later, you little bitch. Hmm. I want to try it on this now. What else should I get? Oh yes, that's right. Of course. Let's go look at this shit. Oh, he died. They died of um, concussion and then a shank. I just got the autopsy report. No drugs or alcohol in Evelyn's system. An estimated time of death doesn't fit Lee's story. She did die from a head wound, but not one that matches the evidence found at the scene. I knew it. It couldn't have been just an accident. Where's his house? More. Evelyn was pregnant. Malik? I'm here. I... We can't let him get away with this, Jensen. He's guilty. He has to be. Can you go to his apartment? And do what? Get proof. Get something. I'm sending you the coordinates. Contact me again when you're there. No oh boy. Well, looks like I'm going around running errands for once. Failed one errand. I think I did kind of good in another, but that was the previous episode. Now I have to go white. Aw, oh, that guy can't see me with that weapon out. Why is he shoot the shit out of me? We're going downtown. I like how it just comes conveniently when you want it to. Oh, I see. I can't go yet. The fuck you, you think? I'm crazy, nigga? Because I am. Can't go to Taiyang Medical just yet. Oh, yeah, that's right. I have to go this way. I think she's dead. That was a girl. Go down. Boom. Take the gun ammo that I didn't manage to pick up earlier. Now. Have to go around. This apartment should just be a little bit up there. If I understand correctly, I don't have to take this path. Let me see. This map at yo. Ah, I see now. Nope, we don't have to go that way. It looks like we have to go down this way, to go up that way, and then we'll go up to his apartment. Then we're gonna find a bunch of shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, now I see now. You had to make it too difficult. I just gotta go around here. Oh yeah, that's right. Chris Brown just hope. She's still sleeping. Holy shit. Come on, girl. Let's get off this building. Come on now. Real easy. Come on. Ah, uh, whatever. I don't have time to, uh... White Knight, or rather, Black Knight women. Nonetheless, it seems that I do have to go that way. And that means the apartment is just over here. Check in. Oh boy. Come on, I don't got time for your bullshit, big boy. The 
It's called pussying out. And I'm proud to do it. Yeah, that old bitch. Come on, send a nuke this way, and then just simply capture it. See? Access granted. And I even got a stop worm to hack into it. That's great. So, what to do now? Malik, look at the evidence. I'm inside Lee's apartment. It doesn't look like anyone's home. Damn. Okay, look. Lee isn't smart enough to properly cover his tracks, so look around. Maybe you can find something suspicious. Three things. You look over here. Malik, I think I got a probable murder weapon. A broken clock. The kicker is the hands line up roughly with Evelyn's TOD. Coincidence? That's a hell of a stretch. You really think? If Lee's as dumb as you say, maybe. We'd need lab tech analysis to confirm, but if there ever was a smoking gun, it fits. I'll keep looking. I'm sure there's more here. Malik, I found a baseball bat, but it looks clean. Almost like it's been washed recently. Maybe Lee washed Evelyn's blood off of it. No That's shit! What I'm thinking, but I'm not sure it could inflict the type of laceration she had. I'll stick around a bit. I'm sure there's still more to find. You look around here. Master player 629! Let's go hack into his account. Maybe he's like a farmer for WoW Gold. Or maybe he's like the second mega upload guy. He does all the file uploading shit from here in Hong Kong or wherever the hell it is. Yeah, we don't have time for this shit. I got it. There we go. Hmm. Malik, looks like Hong Sr. was upset with Hong Jr.'s behavior and threatened to cut off his inheritance if he didn't stop whoring around. Sounds like he considered Evelyn beneath the family name. And if he knew she was pregnant, I... I can't believe Lee would do something like that just for money. Speaking of money... The Hong family seems heavily invested in both Bell Tower and Lim. That could explain the cover-up and lack of a proper investigation. Mm -hmm. I'll make one last sweep to make sure I got everything. Alright. Anything I'm missing? One last sweep to make sure I got everything. The phone. Oh, boy. I guess Lee would be there. It's pretty much a second home for him. Wait a minute, you heard that? Sorry, Jensen. I don't like invading your privacy like this, but it's important. Plus, this gives me an idea. When you're done looking around Lee's apartment, head to the Hive. Contact me when you're there. Okay, I think that's it. I'm heading to the Hive now. I doubt we'll find anything else in here without calling in a forensics team. Sounds good. Alright. Now I just have to go to the Hive. <sighs> What a fun quest. Jensen's Day Off Part 2, it seems. Hopefully this one has doesn't have as much um, dicking around. But then again, it won't have any uh, fast-forward playthroughs and stuff. Okay. That's the gangsta play a hotel. Now watch this. I don't have to give a fuck, so I'm gonna do this. Boom! Hey, little bitches. <laughs> I knocked down this chick. <laughs> oh, fuck, 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 fuck. I'm going in this building. Can't shoot me now, bitch. Yeah. Still bankhead, you can tell. Ain't nothing changed but the name on the mail. And see? Everyone's dead in here. And yet they still don't Man, care. I'm in the hive. What's your plan? Find Lee and talk to him. I want you to convince him you know exactly what he did to Evelyn and why. If you can make him panic, I'm willing to bet he'll spill his guts. Just make it look like blackmail. If he's willing to pay to keep you quiet, he's basically tying his own noose. I'll listen in and record everything. Got it. Let's do it. Let's all get drunk before this. 
Oh, I have praxis points. That's just great. What should I spend it on? You're not gonna find much taking down multiple point opponents, though. Hmm. I could use this. Nah. I'm gonna use this so I can sprint for a little bit longer. Now let's go scare the shit out of this uh, play a guy. Huh. Oh yeah, that's right. Of course, of, co of course, of course. Yeah, that's a secure area. Where is Hong, the little player bitch? Oh, I thought I saw someone in here. Guess not. Anyways, he should be upstairs. You gotta go, like, talk to everyone in the club. But once you find him, you're supposed to make him scared as shit. Pull out the Mac if you have to. He'll be hanging around by himself, though. Nope. Let's go ask this guy. See, there he is. What you want, crow? Is your yeah? I want to have a line. If you a simple two, I strong and ah. All right. Oh yeah. Hmm. Because the police report itself was falsified. Why else would that be, if not to cover? Man, you gotta be. Not only does the evidence not add up, but neither does your testimony. You lied about why Evelyn fell down the stairs in the first place. Big boy. You said you'd both been drinking heavily prior to the accident, and the reason Evelyn fell was because she was drunk. We both know that isn't true. Man, that shit was in the papers. Now, if the evidence doesn't fit, and your story was a lie, then how did Evelyn die on that night? You get it. By hitting her in the head with that antique clock you keep so prominently displayed in your apartment. The lacerations on her head, the intracranial hemorrhaging, it's the perfect match. In my apartment? How the fuck do you know what's in my apartment? Because I was in there. Oh. Fashion, you needed motivation. Something to fuel your violent outbursts. Mm -hmm. She told you she was pregnant, and you panicked. Faced with the prospect of losing your easy way of life, you struck out at her in anger. How? That's impossible. But now the final piece of the puzzle. Hmm. Lim. Your family's sizable investments in Lim assured the autopsy performed on Evelyn's body would never see the light of day, and her death would simply fall through the cracks of an already crumbling justice. Fuck this shit, man! And, and fuck you! I can help you, Lee. But only for a price. Alright, fuck! I can't believe this shit! I'll pay you, man! I'll pay you, just... What do you need from me? Details. Let me hear your side of the story, and then we'll move on from there. I don't... I don't know! Evelyn, that stupid bitch! She was going to ruin me. I... I didn't mean to kill her, okay? Evelyn wouldn't shut up about us, about the baby, so I hit her! I just wanted to make her shut her stupid mouth. But the dumb bitch started freaking out! So I hit her again, and, until I... Until she finally stopped screaming. When I realized what I'd done, I, I panicked. She was barely breathing, so I carried her to the stairs near my apartment and, and dropped her. I had to make sure it looked like an accident. I had no choice! She trapped me! She just wanted my money! I would have been ruined! I need to go. We'll be in contact again soon. Huh? What? What about the evidence? And the money? Where the fuck you going? Goodbye, Lee. I'm going out of here, big boy. Yeah. Please tell me you got a recording of all that. Oh my God, Jensen, I could kiss you right now. Please do. I can't believe you got him to confess so openly like that. To be honest, it was easier than I was expecting. You were definitely right about Lee. He's not exactly the sharpest tool in the shed. No oh boy. Well, don't get too cocky just yet. Before I send our little friend's confession off to the local media and authorities, I want to get some Shanghai street justice first. There's a control panel linked to the hive. I need you to hack. Uploading the coordinates now. 
AKA upstairs. Oh, yes, of course. We just have to go up there. And then you're going to see some street justice. Whoa! It's just up here. There it is. That control panel. Since um, I killed everyone in here, there's nothing to worry about. Except that fucking thing. Shit, how am I going to do this? I enjoy doing this. It's taking fucking forever. Access Boom. We won, nigga. All right, Malik. Attack. What? Verifying the signal. Come on, come on. Okay, I'm in. Remote frequencies are clear, thank God. Uploading now. And done. Meet me in front of the hive, Jensen. I have a little surprise for our friend Lee. Let's go surprise ourselves then. This is gonna be fun. Let's get a good sizable distance away so we can watch the uh, light show. What do you think should be a good distance? Around here, yeah. Jensen. Malik. Jensen. First, take this. I was gonna use it myself, but after everything you've done, I think you deserve it more. So what are you gonna do now? Lee's confession is solid. With that and the evidence from the autopsy, there's no way he can avoid prosecution. Justice will be served. Oh, justice will be served, all right. You might want to stick around for a second. I've got one last little surprise for our friend Lee. Are you right. facing the hive? It's almost showtime. Let's do it In now. In three, two... Malik. Just watch. Big boy! Malik, remind me never to piss you off. <laughs> After everything you've done here for Evelyn, for me, you'd have to try pretty hard, mister. I'm a good kid, aren't I? Yep, I'm a good kid. So that looks like it should be about it for a little friendly time. advice. Stay away from the Yuzhou district. Bell Tower has something going on there. Good point, buddy. I like how close to my face you were. Whatever. That looks like it's about it for part two of Jensen's Day Off. Now we gotta do the main quest. But don't pray. Don't. Yeah. Seriously, nigga. Don't you motherfucking fret. It'll be on in the next episode. So you guys have to fucking wait. Suck my dick.